It's time to take off your clothes, enjoy clothes free living, and join us for Naked, Nudist, and Naturist. Welcome to Naked, Nudist, and Naturist, the show that celebrates clothes free living for all. I'm your host, Frank Stone. And I'm your correspondent, Lisa Monroe, and I'll be reporting on all things within the Naturist community. So it's time to get naked and join us. And enjoy clothes free living on Naked, Nudist, and Naturists. Well, welcome in to Naked, Nudist, and Naturist, episode 18 today. Thank you very much for being with us. We enjoy this time with you. We get to spend it clothes free, enjoying life as it was intended to be enjoyed. Clothes free, no restrictions, no barriers, no trappings. Just the two of us enjoying clothes free life for all of the right reasons. Well, on today's show, of course, uh, we will have uh, a conversation with Lisa Monroe, our weekly naturist correspondent, a little extended version today, as we did last week. And we'll also have part two of my interview with the terrific Helen Berriman, all about women and naturism with the British Naturism Group, a leading advocate not only in the UK but throughout the world in clothes free living for all the right reasons, nudism, naturism, whatever we call it. It all comes down to the same thing, enjoying life as life was intended to be enjoyed. She and her husband, Simon Berriman, are huge advocates all over the world for naturism, nudism, clothes-free living for all the right reasons. So part two today of my interview with the terrific Helen Berriman. We also got a note from a gentleman down in Australia, Queensland, Australia. His name is Dario Western. And Dario Western is a musician and a songwriter, but he's also a naturist advocate. This is from Dario Western and his band, La Zaffaire. Their tune entitled Naked, N-E-K-K-I-D, La Zaffaire Naked. There you go, Dario Western and his band, La Zaffaire, from Australia. And their tune, Naked. And we'll have Dario Western as a guest on this show, Naked Nudists and Naturists, a little bit down the road. So we have that to look forward to as well. We also got a letter from Mark in France. He runs a blog and a website called nudeandhappy.com. We want you to check that out. But here is what he said to us. Dear Frank and Lisa, I hope this email finds you both well. I wanted to express my heartfelt gratitude for featuring my blog, Nude and Happy, on the Naked, Nudist, and Naturist podcast. It was truly an honor to have you read my post and share it with your audience. I wrote a short post about it, and he did. He wrote about our show and his appearance on the show on his uh, blog. Your support and recognition mean the world to me, and I am thrilled to have had the opportunity to introduce Nude and Happy to your listeners. It's incredibly rewarding to know that our shared passion for naturism and nudism resonates with others. Keep up the terrific work you do. For anyone interested in delving deeper into the blog, you can find it at nudeandhappy.com. Additionally, I have also authored a series of books that further explore the world of naturism and body acceptance, which can be found at Amazon. I am always here and available to provide more information or answer any questions about the blog or my books. Please feel free to reach out to me anytime. Once again, thank you for your generosity and for helping me spread the message of body positivity and the joys of naturism. I am truly grateful for your support. Nudist regards, Mark. So we encourage you to check out his website and his blog, nudeandhappy.com. And by the way, we feature everybody here. If you have something you want to promote, maybe a podcast, maybe a book, maybe a blog or a website, let us know because we are in this together. It's not a competition. We are here to help you. We know that you are here to help us because everybody benefits when we help each other. So if there's anything that we can do to help you in your journey in naturism, nudism, clothes free living for all the right reasons, simply let us know and we will make it happen. How about that? 
Well, you are listening to Naked Nudist and Naturist, episode 18 today. We really thank you for being with us. And as you can tell by the music that has been so steadily sneaking up on me the last few moments, it is time for our report from our weekly correspondent on naturism, the terrific Lisa Monroe. Let's welcome in our weekly correspondent on naturism, Lisa Monroe. Good morning, Lisa. How are you today? Good morning, Frank. I'm doing pretty darn good this morning. Hope you are as well. I am. You're doing very well. You're clothes free. You're ready to go. You're smiling. You basically have the world by the tail, looks like to me. Oh, well, you know, you kind of be happy and go through life with a good attitude or you have <laughs> nothing. So... <laughs> His life is sure not going to help. Now, a few episodes ago, I mentioned after you left the studio, we had done our segment and you had somewhere to go, so you had to leave right away. I talked about how you always stand up and dance during your theme music. <laughs> and you haven't totally, re well, you did respond to me a little bit, but maybe just tell our listeners. Uh, first of all, that's true. I, I didn't make that up. The, the, the theme music comes on, you stand up and dance, and you sit back down quietly, put your headphones on. <laughs> And then you were dancing out of the studio. You had to leave right away. The music was playing, and you're dancing out of the studio. Can you, first of all, confirm that it's true? And then secondly, was that okay that I said that? Um, well, we might have a discussion after this <laughs> <laughs> on that topic. Um, yeah. how, well, you know how I am. The music just moves me, and I yeah. do love the theme. So, yeah. Um, yeah. yes, it's, it's, it's a fun thing, and dancing is, you know, I love to dance, so oh, yeah. got to move and groove with the tunes. Always great to talk to you, our weekly correspondent, Lisa Monroe. And Lisa, go out there and have a great, close-free, highly smiling week, and we'll see you next time. Okay, Frank, you too. Stay naturist. All right, thank you. <laughs> Let's get to part two now of my interview with the terrific Helen Berryman. She is the coordinator of Women in Naturism for British Naturism, and she and her husband, Simon Berryman, go all over the place promoting naturism on TV, on radio, on podcasts, in print. As I told you before, she has three jobs. She can be nude and is nude in all three jobs. How about that? So let's get to it right now. Part two of my interview with the terrific Helen Berryman. Looking at British naturism, it says uh, they had their 50th anniversary in 2014. So obviously this would be the 59th year, right? Is that my understanding? My math okay? Yep, yep. So next year we're planning some big 60th celebrations. Yeah, you should, yeah. And it talks about uh, the executive committee is 14 individuals, and you're one of those 14. You have that right? I think so, yeah, yeah. Okay. And tell us your position again. So I'm the Women in Naturism officer. Okay. And your job is to just promote naturism to women specifically as much as you can? Yeah, um, it's to sort of, yeah, like you say, promote naturism, think of different things that women might want to do, be the voice for women. Um, you know, the panel is heavily male and, you know, men and women don't think the same all the time. So, no. you know, you've got to have a bit of a, um, a female representative there. Um, but but there, there's about four or five women now on the exec, so the, the, the balance is leveling out a little bit. Well, again, great to talk to you. Uh, Helen Berryman, uh, a highly respected and admired here for sure in other places throughout the world because of your views, because of your stance that naturism, close free living is the way to go for all of the right reasons. And uh, Helen Berryman, thank you very much. So let's definitely talk again soon. Thanks, Frank. You bet. Thank you. The terrific Helen Berryman from the UK, Women in Naturism through British Naturism as her position. Remember, she has three jobs, all of them nude. She has the dream life, and she and her husband, Simon Berryman, go all over the place promoting naturism, nudism, clothes free living for all the right reasons. They've been everywhere, TV, radio, podcasts, in print. And we thank Helen Berryman for all of her time on today's show. Always out there promoting naturism for all. Well, thank you for being with us on Naked, Nudist, and Naturist, episode 18 today. We give you a brand new show every Saturday morning at 6 o'clock a.m. Eastern Time. Continue to join us. Check us out on our website, nakednudistandnaturist.com, Spotify, Google, Amazon slash Audible, Apple Podcasts. 
And also on Twitter. You can write us anywhere, anytime, anyplace. And uh, we thank you for being with us uh, today. Plan to join us for every single one of our shows here and have your clothes off when you're listening. We have our clothes off when we're broadcasting, enjoying the naturist life. We celebrate clothes-free living for all. Remember to enjoy being naked and join us again for Naked Nudist and Naturist. We drop a brand new show every Saturday morning, so come back and join us. Have your clothes off when you do for Naked Nudist and Naturist. Have a great clothes-free day.